you take a picture? Hi, cows. Are okay. you getting out the car? Yeah, quickly. Y'all, I was trying to make a cute story. This going to get out the car. <laughs> detained in these isolation cells 23 hours behind the locked cell and one hour outside only to exercise on the spaces over here there were no toilets they were using the bucket system no meals provided only a diet of rice water was supplied power was supplied so these were the light switches only operating from outside. An easy way of disorientating the prisoners by playing with the lights, sometimes keeping them on all night and all day to disorientate the prisoners. itself it was met on the 16th of june in 1976 so that's what like 42 years ago there was a soweto uprising where all the high schools of soweto they were going to be joining on a peaceful protest well they were going to be protesting against learning in africans as a medium of instruction they never really hated africans africans was just simply a hard language for them to be learning just like that as a medium of instruction Hector Peterson was not short here. When we are going to Mandela's house, 200 meters away from here, you are going to pass by the corner of Bilagazi and Muyama Street. So that is where more than 15,000 students on that day, they were sadly confronted by over 350 policemen. Different heights of those walls, tall, medium, shortness. Well, that would also symbolize your different ages and different genders of those students who took part and parcel on the march. Normally the water flows going up until that direction. Mm. So when the water would reach the edge, also symbolizing the tears of the parents who are still crying, who never got to see their children anymore after the march, as the water would flow going that direction, also symbolizing the cleansing of the blood that was shed by the ones who lost their lives. Can we see the small stones inside the podium? Also representing the only weapons that those students had to protect themselves against the barrel of the gun. They never had any weapons, they only had stones. The line of craft right here, it's also known or called as the firing line or the confrontation line. Remember when the policemen were throwing a line down for the students? Starting from the entrance of the museum, the line goes all the way at the corner of Villagas and Muyama Street. That is where the red line was drawn. That's where Hector Peterson's body was lying. But then due to space, that's why the museum was built here. They had no space. himself with their name and the character that's reading from Tandi, Victor, Zinkle, Anna, the grandma, Christopher, and the vendor. Nyanda, I'm Anna. 
head to toe black attire indicative of her forlorn mood. So everybody close, appoint a new detective, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. Close eyes, close eyes. We're making a new rule. Oh. Everybody hands out. Okay, hands back, hands back, hands back, hands back, hands back. The mafia, wake up. Kill a person. <laughs> I'm pointing at you to say to close your eyes. <laughs> and the mafia, please open the eyes. Kill someone. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Stop by! Wow. Did you get a good one? Is this Signal Hill? Signal Hill. We're going all the way up. 